Look at how many cameras I have. Camera, 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 camera? Hey everyone, I'm Rahi Patel, your curiosity correspondent, and I built a camera out of my bathroom using nothing but some duct tape, aluminum foil, cardboard, and some bath towels. I made it into something called a pinhole camera, and it's different from my nine other cameras in one crucial way. It doesn't have this, a lens. These are typically the most expensive parts of cameras, but luckily, because of physics, you don't need one to build your own camera. So that's what I want you to do. I'm challenging you to build your own pinhole camera, but I'm not gonna show you how to make one in this video. There are plenty of videos on the internet for that already. Instead, I'm gonna explain to you why I built mine out of my bathroom. All cameras consist of three things. A light proof box, a small hole to let some of the light in, and something to capture the image, like film or a digital sensor. For their light proof box, most people use a cardboard box. I decided to use my bathroom instead. To make it completely dark, I used towels and duct tape to cover up the door cracks. For the camera hole, I used a piece of cardboard and some aluminum foil with a hole poked through it. To see the image, I covered a cutting board with white paper and propped it up on a tripod. Here's what my picture looked like. Try and guess what it is. I'll show you at the end. What are you going to make your camera out of? As long as you have these three components, you have a camera. So as you're building and experimenting with your pinhole camera, see if you can answer some of these questions. Why is the image upside down? Can you brighten the image by making the hole bigger? Why do most cameras have lenses? What other questions can you come up with? Here is a giant camera obscura that Sienna Construction made for the 2019 Cambridge Science Festival. How is your camera different from theirs? How bold and ambitious can you be? Once you have a basic understanding of how cameras work, look at the work Camera Culture Group is doing at MIT's Media Lab. They're pushing the limits of camera technology. Your phone can capture slow-mo video at 120 frames per second. But this research group made a camera that can capture video at 1 trillion frames per second. That's so fast that you can see light moving from one end of a Coke bottle to the other. I hope you all learn a lot and have fun with this project. Oh, and one more thing. Don't forget to be curious. Um, I just realized that I can't get out of this bathroom without breaking the camera. So I think there's only one thing left to do. Here we go. Yeah.